Um, I've been using torpedo weighted steel for a few years now. I don't really don't really run any copper anymore. There's torpedo weighted steel. I think there's a lot of benefits to it. Uh, it's very, its ease of handling is phenomenal. It doesn't kink. It doesn't uh, back spool on the reel. And for one thing, I know is you can lay it out on the floor and it won't tangle up. And you can put it right back on the reel. So I'm going to show you how I have it. Um, how I have it terminated here. It's basic swivel. The fluorocarbon. About how many feet a liter do you typically run that? I, I usually start with about 25 to 30 feet. And once it gets shorter than 15, then I put a new piece on. Um, you know, I, I haven't noticed any difference in liter length myself. You know, 30 feet to where I start. And then uh, once it gets too short, I'm going to go from there. So how I have this terminated is the same way I do my slide divers. Nothing different here. I've got a unity uni knot with my leader and a little piece of braid. This braid's a little short. Uh, I've retied it a couple times. Normally I start off with about a foot so that I have room to retie it. And then right here, this is just your plain Albright knot. You just be careful to leave a nice tag end with the braid because if it does slide a little bit, it doesn't slide through. And a little tag end for the steel. And the main reason you're using that little piece of braid in there between I, I've had I've had issues with if you want to run lighter fluorocarbon say 20 pound or 15 pound if you're running spoons early in the season the, the the wire will cut through the fluorocarbon so I put that 65 pound braid in there so I know it, my fluorocarbon's not going to get cut by the by the line by the steel okay so we're going to spool some out on the floor here just like you know like you were trying to get a knot out or something, we're going to pull that on the floor. Notice there's no kinks, there's no tangles, no nothing. How much do you think we should put on here? I don't think we should do the whole 300 feet on it. Oh, let's do 400 feet. Let's, do 400. let's go into the backing, Matt. <laughs> no, let's not go into the backing. No backing? Okay. But I wouldn't be afraid to do it. That's, that's probably good there. All right, so that's yep. maybe 50, 60 feet. I'm going to hold got, it in this hand. Yeah, you got it all coiled up there, yep. and I don't see any kinks at all on nope. there at all. Spool. Spool's just fine from taking it off nice and light. No issues there. Yep, didn't blow up on you. Nope. I'm going to put it right back on the rail. No pressure at all. No backlashes. Right back to my knot. And that's one of the beauties of weighted steel. It's a it's a magical thing. No back spooling and no tangles, no knots, no nothing.